Welcome to Paris, to this wonderful city. I'm very happy to be here. I was at the OECD headquarter today to make my little protest against Mr. Corman, the sleepy director general, who is not enlarging the union of market democracies and competing with BRICS. I have made my small stunt with my seven flags for Ukraine, Austria, Kosovo to join NATO. I apologize to Bosnia that I didn't have the flag with me, but I had also NATO flag and EU flag. Because here I'm calling for the EU to join NATO and France to be a better France, yeah, to be the pillar and rock of our defense. I hope, of course, the UK will return to the European Union, but France is the only nuclear power. We need her strong, we need her to be with us, and we need, of course, French weapons for Ukraine much more, decisively much more. Here at the Seine, I say, at the Bacon of Freedom, at this wonderful city, it's really amazing. I have to say, also much cleaner than London and much more organized. Of course, the European Union factor is there and I call for the UK to return. There is no doubt and I made that case very clear. But here, of course, I say what we need. We need, of course, a strong Europe. UK and Ukraine are united in the European Union. France as well to help us much more at the decisive battlefields in eastern Ukraine to win this decisive war. And of course, when it comes to the Middle East, we need a better policy. I will make several videos about it. Uh, the the uh, ex-Iran, of course, you know, the defeat of Iran. And of course, a mandate in Gaza is much better than the Israeli intervention. I will make that case very clear and I'm calling for that. Yes, and we need Euro bonds, obviously, and the Mercosur FTA and the FTA with the United States and not the US alternative to NATO or something or some kind of anti-American project, but united with our American allies. We are the West, we are the free world. The OECD will be the capital, uh, also the union of the free world, basically. And Paris will be the capital of the free world. And that's quite attractive. I was just uh, pledging that uh, to Jacques Chirac here. Here's the boulevard in his name. I loved it and I loved him. He was a good president, not like Macron. Okay, you can improve if you support now Albania and North Macedonia and Montenegro in the European Union. I will sing your praise for a long time. <laughs> That's my main messages here from Paris. Watch my speech tomorrow and looking very much forward. Happy to be back in Paris. Yeah, here it's really very, very nice city. I like it. It's the European Union. It's beautiful. I show you some of the impressions here at in the evening. It's really very wonderful. I recommend you also to come here. It's not uh, the hotel situation. Hopefully, is better than in London. Um, but you know, London really needs to be back in the European Union to be cleaner and uh, a little bit tidied up. <laughs> Thanks a lot. More to come in the coming days from Pax Europeana here. It is end of October travel at this very decisive time. It will be very complicated, by the way. I made it very clear in the coming year. It will be one of our hardest. We are in the new 1973 and the Russians know the playbook very well. And we have unfortunately not uh, learned out of our history. But we will win. Freedom always wins. That's for sure. Thanks a lot.